Hey YouTube, uh, BA Sports, welcome back to the channel, man. Uh, <clears throat> hope y'all caught my last video, uh, tearing into these, uh, reverse retros, uh, finishing up the collection. Uh, as you may know, may or may not know, uh, I did order all 32. Uh, so I, I have both sets. I have the 1.0s, the full set, and the 2.0s, so happy to be able to say that, uh, uh, pretty exciting and it's a big deal for me to say that I have uh both sets in in completion uh, uh the last uh, eight I ordered uh through Ben H Sports uh Ben is a great guy uh I know a lot of the collectors uh fellow collectors on YouTube deal with Ben uh I deal with Ben and uh of course NHL shop and uh, a company named sportsk.com uh sportsk is more of my regular choice, uh, just because, uh, they have very, very quick shipping and it's, uh, uh, cheap if you're in the States. Now I think it's a little bit more if you live in uh, Canada, but, uh, for me living in the States, $2 shipping and, uh, they're pretty, pretty quick about getting it to you. But, uh, these all came from Ben. The last uh, eight to complete the set came from Ben H Sports. Ben's a great guy. I had to get him to postpone shipping these because I was on a cruise for Christmas uh, for a couple weeks and I didn't want him to ship these and them be delivered and no one home. So I had Ben wait till after the first of the year to ship these things out to me. So uh, appreciate Ben for doing that. Ben, if you see this, thank you, buddy. Uh, but we're going to unbox the rest of these hope you caught that last one which was uh the arizona coyotes a uh, very nice jersey uh ready to show you guys the next one in line i did get a glimpse of it uh when i took that coyote one out uh, i did get a glimpse of it i do know which one it is but i'm going to show you guys we'll unbox it we'll check it out together so the next one in line don't know if you can tell right here or not but if you know jerseys you know which one it is it is the new york islanders fisherman jersey we finally in a certain form get this guy back uh i know a lot of people including myself uh has been wanting the fisherman uh, logo to come back uh my big problem with this jersey is it's not exact to the original Fisherman jersey. Uh, I would have preferred it to have been a, a more exact look compared, but I'm happy with this one. Uh, but we'll tear into this bad boy and check it out. So, hope everybody's having a good uh, good week, a uh, good day, good afternoon, all that. So, get that out of there. So, pretty uh, pretty glad to get this jersey and see this bad boy firsthand. So, uh, it's got a lot of raised embroidery in it. Uh, I mean, honestly, there's raised embroidery everywhere, so that's that's cool. Uh, his uh, hands are raised. His beard is raised, which is uh, really cool. I like how his, uh, his beard is uh, raised up at the brim of his hat. All this texture right in here is raised up. The outline, you can kind of see it right there in the video. The outline and the Islanders, it's all raised up. The waves right here, the teal or aqua, uh, it's raised up. The white isn't too raised, but this teal right in here is really, uh, really raised up. Uh, but yeah, pretty nice. Uh, I really, <laughs> it's crazy because I really love how his uh his beard i don't know if y'all guys can really see that or not but his beard is raised up so it really gives that that beard a 3d look that's that's really cool uh i like that touch uh that's probably the coolest thing about all the the prime green raised embroidery is how that beard sticks out there really gives it the the feel you know uh on this particular jersey there is no shoulder patches would have loved love to see that lighthouse logo come back uh i always really 
I like that about the original Fisherman jersey was that Lighthouse logo. Uh, I would have loved to have seen that come back. Uh, of course, it is a blank. Uh, they uh, threw back to 1995. And let me guess, June of 22 is the born on date. So, so far, like I said, every one of them is uh, June. Uh, get that tag back down in there. Got the great, awesome, three only the three stripes on the back. No word mark, no Adidas word mark. Love that. Uh, once you see that, you won't, you, if you're like me, I don't even like the, the word mark on there at all now. So like if you buy a traditional jersey, you still get the word mark. But I love how they took it away for the reverse retro. Would love to see them completely do away with it uh, in general. Uh, actually, I forgot to even, it'd been a minute since I unboxed one of these. I've uh, been waiting on to get them. Uh, I didn't even check my Coyote one. I will have to go back and check it out. This is so down. The neckline in this one is so down. So I'm pleased with that. Uh, some of them are, some of them ain't. Uh, that's been a pretty hot topic amongst uh, collectors and people on uh, on YouTube uh, about which ones are so down, which ones not. Uh, you got the, instead of the wave pattern, like on the original, you had the wave pattern. They just do a diagonal stripe, uh, which is uh, into the material, sublimated in. It's no additional, uh, no additional stitching. Somebody on YouTube, and I'm sorry that I cannot remember. Uh, maybe BW Hockey or post to post. I can't. I can't remember. But somebody pointed this out, and until they pointed it out, nobody really paid attention. How this stripe. Suddenly, see how they don't line up? You got the front, so it's way up here on the front. But on the back, it's at the bottom. So, very weird. I agree with that. Let me see if I can get that where you guys can really see. So, there's the seam. There's where the stripes come. They just end suddenly in that, that side seam. And somebody pointed that out. And for some people, once you see that, you can't unsee it. Uh... Does it really bother me because I don't wear my jerseys, uh, as you all know. Uh, I don't wear, I don't even wear them for videos. Uh, I buy them, they go in a, a tote or a closet, one of the two. But that is extremely weird how those lines don't line up and uh, they just then just end suddenly. But it is what it is. What are you going to do about it? But yep, it is a. Nice jersey. I, I know a lot of people, a lot of people glad to get this guy back. He, like, when I came into hockey, that's how I remember the Islanders. This is the logo that, that they were using at the time when I started getting into hockey because it was around 95, 96 when I really got into the sport of hockey. Uh, I have a video about that. I don't want to dig into that deeply but uh when i got into hockey this is how i remember the islanders this logo uh so glad to see this one back i don't have the original fisherman uh wish i did uh but glad to have this one uh glad to get this in my collection and uh let you guys check it out i know a lot of you guys and uh people have done seen it done unboxed it done have it i'm a little late on this one but there it is. I uh, just want to say uh, thank you for uh, watching my videos. It's appreciated a lot. Uh, please hit that like and the subscribe button. I would it means the world to me. Uh, thank each and every one of you uh, for coming back and watching all these videos that I shoot. I just do it off. Uh, I know why phone. I'm no professional. Uh, just gives me an opportunity to express my love for hockey and my love for collecting jerseys. That's really all I'm here for. I uh, just want to, you know, express my love for the sport. Uh, and uh, appreciate it. And uh, hit that like and subscribe button. And we'll catch you guys on the next one.